Is it fear or is it war plan? China tells PLA soldiers to write goodbye letters to their beloveds. If there were any doubts that China has transformed into a full-fledged rogue state, they have been laid to rest by the coronavirus pandemic and its aftermath. China has picked up too many battles, with the deadly clash at the Galwan Valley being just the tip of the iceberg, as India is giving a reply to China in the only language it understands. In a development which signals the possibility of a full-blown military conflict with India and Taiwan, China's People's Liberation Army has asked its soldiers in the province of Fujian, opposite Taiwan, to write goodbye letters to their spouses. Xi Jinping is rapidly turning into a splitting image of Adolf Hitler. From committing unimaginable atrocities against the Uyghur Muslims and running a holocaust-like detention centers to unleash a pandemic which threatens to wipe off the entire human civilization, Jinping has done it all and he is in no mood to stop. China is continuing to expand aggressively at the expense of other nations. But India is not letting China escape scot-free, which is quite evident from the deadly clash at the Galwan Valley and its series of economic decisions which threatens to severely batter the Chinese economy. As murmurs of a military conflict continue to arise, PLA has asked its soldiers to write goodbye letters to their spouses, with soldiers being asked about what they would write if war broke out the next day. This comes in the backdrop of the statement by India's Chief of Defence Staff, General Bipin Rawat, that if talks with China fail, military option is on the table. While China is engaged in talks with India, ever since the violent clash at Galwan Valley, it refuses to maintain the status quo. At the time, when the soldiers near the Taiwan border are made to write the letters, it is not far-fetched to say that the PLA will adopt this strategy for their entire force keeping in mind the fact that Xi Jinping has placed China on the brink of war with India, Taiwan and Japan. It seems that the PLA has genuine fears that its soldiers will likely not meet their loved ones again as all three, India, Taiwan and Japan, have capabilities and the political will to annihilate China if the situation arises. This development also signals the fear which has taken over the PLA soldiers after Indian soldiers brutally crushed their attempt to transgress into Indian territory. While India, acting like a true democratic and transparent country, has revealed and honoured its martyrs, the CCP not only refused to announce the casualty figure on its side, but also prevented proper funerals and burials for its fallen soldiers. According to various US intelligence reports, the toll on China's side was over 35, much more than India's casualties. Hence, it comes as no surprise that Xi Jinping and his lackeys have ordered their soldiers to write goodbye letters to their spouses as they know what will happen in case of a military conflict with India. Xi Jinping is acting like a dead man walking who wants to unleash havoc but has met his match in India, which might well be the end of the Xi Jinping regime in the advent of war.